everybody. <laughs> it's Michelle. It's been a while, I know. I've been doing some projects, but I never remember to film them. So I'm going to do a little um, tutorial on um, some of the things that I do to uh, visualize an art project before I actually do it. If that makes sense. So let me turn the camera around. Hold on. Okay. So if you watched my last video, you you'll remember that I um, dye was dyeing fabric with acrylic paint and blotting it with paper towels, and the paper towels were so pretty I couldn't throw them away. I'll link the video um, in the description that I'm referring to. But so I had these um, all these colorful paper towels, and I also had an, a canvas that. I had um, previous artwork on and it was, uh, I resined it and the resin was not, it just turned out bad. So I basically had a canvas that I couldn't really do much with. So I decided to do um, paper mache over it. So I just used glue and water. That's it. Um, glued it on and it's all dry. It's, I've had it for a while now before I decided to do anything with it. but. What I want to show is, you know, there's several ideas that I have with this, but I don't know how it's going to look. So I'm going to give you, I'm going to show you some tricks. <laughs> it's not cheating because I'm not, I'm not stealing anybody's art. It's just ideas and, um, well, just stay tuned and I'll give you an idea what I'm talking about. Okay, so I went to the clip art library and I, I typed in bird on a wire silhouette okay and so there'll be several different images and I picked that one anyways I've already downloaded it so I'm gonna show you what I do to okay, I'm gonna show you what I do okay so this is the image that I downloaded and what I'm gonna do now I'm gonna go to my edit button Oh, and by the way, I have an Android Samsung, um, what is it? I forgot what it's called. <laughs> Samsung Android. Anyways, not all phones are the same. So anyways, I'm, I'm at the edit part and I'm going to go to this little cutout right here and I'm going to draw around the image. Okay. So you see that it has like, I don't know if you can see it has all like a little cut out just around the image so I'm gonna press okay for that so you see well some of the tails didn't go but that's fine because this is just a mock-up all right so I'm gonna press save okay so now I'm gonna go to my favorite um, editor is ultimate photo mixer all right so i'm gonna first go to um the picture of my canvas i'm looking through my phone this is weird okay let me just look at this here all right so there's my i'll resize it Put the whole thing in there okay now it's because i'm doing the birds i'm going to go sideways like that I mean I could I could just put the birds like this but for this tutorial I'll show it to you this way and then I'll move it and show you what I was talking about all right so there's that and then I'm gonna go up here and I'm gonna lock that so it won't move anymore until I unlock it all right so I'm gonna go to photos I'm gonna go to gallery and I'm gonna get that photo that I um, cut out of the birds on the wire all right, so there's that. All right, so when they when the photos first go on um, Ultimate Photo, it's it's um, it's transparent, so you have to to uh, to move those lines over to make them opaque. But say if you wanted it to be almost like ghost like, you can you know you can have it. If this is what how how you were gonna do art, but I am just doing this for the for the image for the idea to see what it looks like okay so there's that and then I'm going to press check and I'm going to press that and um, 
it's gonna it's gonna oh, it's gonna give me a commercial which I'm gonna every parent hopes that their son or daughter will have a carefree child all right so let me get all right so let me X out of that commercial all right so it's gonna have um, a watermark at the bottom and so I'm gonna press OK and that's with the watermark at the bottom but if you press this little button right here that says remove watermark they want you to sign up for their stuff but I say no thanks and then remove water watermark one time by watching an ad. So I'll remove it, then I'll watch an ad, which I gotta, <clears throat> I have to mute it because, well, wait, that's my thing. I have to mute it uh, so I won't get uh, copyright infringement. Oh, of course. Hold on just a second. Okay, so the ads are over. So it says a reward granted. So I'm going to press X. And so that picture will be saved in my gallery as um, with no watermark on it. So that gives, you know, see some of the tails didn't come out, but that's fine. I mean, I'm just seeing what that looks like. Now, I have a couple other um, images in here save just for ideas so i'm gonna go ahead and go home and sometimes it lets you sometimes it it makes you start all over but this one is gonna let me so so see how i'm on this picture i can just go to trash right there now i go to photos gallery and i'm gonna click on one of the other ones that i did i didn't uh, hollow this one out but i can erase it i'll show you all right so let me turn, <laughs> let me unlock this. I'm going to turn it back this way. And then I'm going to lock it again. Lock. Lock. Okay. I'm going to get my ice cream. All right. Make it opaque. Ooh. Wait, I forgot to, huh? All right. So anyways, I forgot to cut this one out. But that's fine because look, I could do this. And you can kind of see it. But what I wanted to do was, okay, so I'm going to press erase. And I'm going to erase. Well, I was going to. Let me, let me get my eraser right size. All right. Adjusting the eraser. So let me erase the middle of the ice cream out. So Because I want the colors from the painting to show. So I kind of have the outline of this. Man, I'm terrible at this. Why did I use this? Okay, let me go back. back to this. I always forget what I'm doing here. All right, erase, erase. So I'm going to use my stylus pen for more precise. So I'm going to go ahead and save this and I don't care about the watermark. I'm not going to worry about that because this is just for, I don't have to watch an ad. All right. So it should be in my gallery. There it is. Now, don't look, it's at the bottom anyways. So I can just crop it right out. Um, but I will also want to do a some enhancement to it um, with my uh, photo editor. Come on, what are you doing? Um, I don't think it's working. Okay, <laughs> it's not being nice. Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and use a pen and I'm gonna highlight around the ice cream. That's way too thick, but I can erase part of that. Okay, I'm going to go to erase now. Erase half that. 
I can make the lines smaller. I just didn't do it. See, I don't know if I want to, you know, get rid of all the color there. So I'm just kind of making a shadow around it. Oops. I pressed back because I made a mistake. Okay. Now, sorry about the light. Um, now I'm going to change the color to something else on the other side, like a light side and a dark side. Oops. So, kind of gives you an idea what, you know, I like that ice cream. What do you think? I'm so sorry. I'm trying to figure out how to show this to the one camera to the other. Weird. Okay. So, okay. I'll we'll press save. All right. So there's then there's that idea. So now I should have yeah, the, the bird and the ice cream. Um, okay, so this one, I have a piece of plastic over the painting. And I'm just going to take a marker. And actually, I'm going to do follow things along. This looks like a good place for cinnamon. Still can barely see it. Jeez. I'm so sorry. I'll show a picture afterwards. I'm going to draw this and then I'll show a picture afterwards. The light is terrible. Okay, so <laughs> it was really hard to draw with the pen. I couldn't get it to work very well, but I was trying to make mountains and trees and that's like the sun <laughs> and a waterfall and with the lake and trees around it anyways it's just an idea of course you could take your time and do it a little better than i do <laughs> actually these really do help me because i'm not a very good drawer <laughs> as you can see so yes anyways <laughs> well i don't know if any of my uh tutorial actually is going to help you but I, I i'm on i'm on art sites with other people and you know sometimes they ask questions like oh what do you think i should do like a a pink background or a brown background and i'm like put it on your on your photo editor and draw some pink around it or some brown around it you and then when i tell them that they're like oh, i never thought of that so that's why I do it, and that's why I did it. Uh, maybe have other people just don't think about it. It's not cheating. It's just, you know, some people are visual. You have to see it to know. I mean, a lot of times you won't see it till you're done, and then it's too late. <laughs> so. So I just wanted to pop on here real quick to tell you that um, I did this video about a couple weeks ago and I didn't release it because the day that I made that video, AI came out and I'm like, this stupid little video that I did about my remedial uh, um, phone and computer knowledge. Um, but then I realized, you know what, there's more people like me, so 
where I'm just going to do it. Go for it. <laughs> so, so anyways, I hope you enjoy. I hope you get some use out of it. <laughs> All right. Thanks. <laughs>